Temperature monitoring and crystalline temperature strips. The National Institute for Health and Clinical Excellence offers extremely clear guidelines about managing patient temperature in order to avoid inadvertent perioperative hypothermia. Given that operating theatres tend to be quite cold and that patients are anaesthetised for many types of surgery, which reduces circulation, it is very easy for patients to lapse into hypothermia. The most accurate reading, the gold standard if you will, is an esophageal core probe inserted nasally into the esophagus. Crystalline temperature strips, which are placed on the forehead, offer an effective solution to this problem and moreover, they help reduce infection risk, a point to which I will return momentarily. Crystalline temperature strips are able to continuously monitor a mathematically equivalent correspondent of esophageal core and are more effective at doing so than rectal or auxiliary skin alternatives. From an infection prevention point of view, a crystalline temperature strip that is placed on the patient from admission to recovery, sometimes 24 hours or longer, will not be in contact with anything else, meaning that there is no contamination risk from other equipment. In contrast, any equipment that must be handled in order to monitor temperature, or repeatedly applied and then removed, carries a much greater contamination risk. There is a wealth of data and independent studies supporting the clinical efficacy and accuracy of crystalline strips. They have been widely used in the USA and elsewhere over many years. Indeed, over 3 million are used annually in the USA alone. Crystalline strips do not replace the need to use esophageal core temperature, but do provide the most cost-effective, reliable, proven method of continuous temperature monitoring in compliance with the NICE guidance. They will accurately track patient temperature's trend relative to esophageal core. If the strip indicates a change, an esophageal core measurement should be taken to assess fully.